Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us on this Sunday night. We had a chilly morning with temperatures falling into the 30s, but we were covered quite nicely with those temperatures warming into the 60s and even some 70s this afternoon. 72 in Harvey, Carrington, Jamestown and Gwinter, but at the bottom of your screen there, 73 in Wheaton and in Sisseton. Here in Fargo, 68 degrees was our high temperature today, as well as in Grafton, 67 in Grand Fork, 65 in Thief River and Baudette, 66 in Park Rapids and Monomid. Right now in Fargo, we still have a bit of a breeze that's keeping us a little bit more mild. Currently 56 at 11.08 p.m. Really not doing too bad tonight. Night. Wind is out of the south southeast at 8 miles per hour and in Grand Forks seeing clear skies 46 feeling like 42, but still above average wind is out of the south at 8 miles per hour. Now we have a uh, temperatures mostly in the 50s still at this hour 48 in Baudette 45 in Bemidji 46 in Wadena and Jamestown. The rest of us are still in the low 50s. We have a lot of changes on the way over the next week. Tomorrow, kickstarting the brand new week. It's going to be the warmest day of the week as well with abundant sunshine, just some high clouds. But come Tuesday, those temperatures start to fall and the wind starts to increase. And then by Wednesday, we have cloudier conditions, cooler conditions, breezier conditions, and a chance for some rain showers. Let's time out the rest of tonight first in your hour by hour forecast. A few high level wispy clouds through the overnight hours, but it's the wind through the overnight out of the south that's going to keep temperatures from falling into the 30s. By the time we're waking up on our Monday morning, temperatures will be in the 40s, so about 10 degrees above average. The wind continues to increase out of the south southeast throughout your day on Monday, and temperatures though are going to be warming up into those upper 60s and low 70s again. And this uh, picture shows that it's looking pretty cloudy, but these are going to be high level clouds uh, that shouldn't obstruct your day too much. Overall, a gorgeous way to start the week. Here in Fargo, we'll start our day with a temperature of 46 by the 6 o'clock hour, warming all the way up to 74 with lots of sunshine by the 4 o'clock hour. But the breeze out of the south sustained in the teens, gusting into the 20s. A snapshot of your hometown forecast by 4 p.m. shows 68 in Devil's Lake, 70 Jamestown and Valley City, 71 in Grand Forks and Thief River Falls, 70 in Bemidji. Tonight's viewer photo coming from Brad Olson, a foggy start to the morning at Lake Ashtabula. Absolutely love this photo. Thank you so much for taking the time to upload it to valleynewslive.com. Again, we have lots of changes that are taking place over the next three days. Take advantage of the Monday. It's going to be the warmest one with well above average temperatures. Our average in Fargo, 55 degrees. We're headed towards 74. A little closer to average as we head into Tuesday. The wind picks up even more and then cooling down into the 40s to near 50 degrees for your Wednesday with most of the rain staying in South Dakota. Uh, I think it could move up as far north as the Central Valley, but right now it's looking to stay mostly to the south. Come Thursday morning, temperatures dipping into those upper 20s and lower 30s, meaning it's going to be a cold start to your morning with freeze very likely across the entire region. And we only warm up into the 40s again for Thursday, Friday, looking a little bit more mild for the weekend some 50s. All right. Well, we better enjoy the 70 tomorrow. Yes. <laughs> 74. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much, Summer.